I mean, I, I really believe that part of the motivation behind murdering Ella was to have his mother all to himself. And he had that again for eight straight years. So I don't sit and go, oh, wow, this is so nice. They're getting along so well. I sit and I listen to what Paris says and I listen to his tone. There's no warm fuzzies. When I found out about his heart condition, I almost felt like it was my fault in a way. And I regret that he's going to grow up with me in here and knowing me like this. And I hate that my actions taint the relationship. But at the same time, I'm so happy right. to have him. And I think that he'll get to know me much better through my letters. I know that he's not ready yet for some of the content of the letters because a lot of times I'm writing about prison. So I asked my mother to just put those letters in a box for him and give them to him when he was 12 or 13. I'm letting the person who killed my child talk to my child. And the only reason I'm letting it happen is because I have forgiven him and they are related, but I'm never gonna be comfortable with it. I will never be comfortable with Paris and Phoenix. Harris tried to stab Charity at the house one day. So we took him to a psychiatric place up in Wichita Falls. Charity wouldn't let me go with her to pick him up. And I never even found this out until after Ella was murdered and we were talking with the police. But the psychiatrists up there had evaluated Paris and they had told Charity that he had homicidal tendencies. And she didn't leave him in treatment there. She chose to take him back. I believe it was November of 2006. And then Ella died February of 2007. I feel like even if Paris had stayed at that place, it wouldn't have helped him. I don't know, I can't, I can't spend a whole lot of time anymore double guessing the past. And I don't have any regrets, except for the fact that I had relapsed. When Paris was 12 and Ella was three and a half, I relapsed on cocaine. You want nectarines or plums? Oh, no. <laughs> Say that again. P. P for plum. For about three months, Paris took up the slack I mean, he knew that something was going on, and he really started to look after his little sister. 